They'll be calling you a ga radical. We got some great news. I got to get back to what I do and who I am and the information. I'm not a vlogger. I'm an activist, economist. Oh yeah, historian, plaster, in the street artist. Oh yeah, I'm not a vlogger. I'm not a vlogger. I'm not a re analysis of the analysis. Am I an uh, information giver? Am I a teacher? Am I a philosopher? Am I an artist? Am I a worker? I'm an activist. Am I a cancer survivor? Fighter for the truth? Oh yeah, I'll, I'm not a vlogger. I am not a fucking vlogger. Don't confuse me with the analysis of the analysis. I don't fucking, I don't even know how to take a fucking screenshot. We have some great fucking breaking news coming out, finding out Fukushima. And everybody says, ooh, yeah, take it with six grains of salt, obviously, because it's TASS reporting it. I mean, think about it. Propaganda, oh, them Russians are nothing but propagandists. What the fuck are they here? You want to talk propaganda? <laughs> the Americans are the greatest propagandists in the history of fucking mankind. Operation Foxconn coming right out of your fucking box television. Anderson fucking Vanderbilt. Fucking Wolf fucking let's fucking juice you fucking blitzer. Fucking Sanjay Gupta fucking radiation's good for you. Fuck it doesn't hurt anybody. Godzilla will save us from Japan. Sick fucks. They say they're gonna study. They're going over and they're gonna start studying the water. Let me help you out. Let me scientists let this fucking old washed out fucking leukemia fucking victim with no money and a fucking $200 YouTube camera help you fucks out. Hello? Yeah, that's even Ken Bucket Fuck Buesler, that fucking rat who blew all Woodhull's money. You do know that, that fucker. <laughs> amazing, amazing. That's June 2011. 25 miles off the shores of Fukushima, 300 meters down into the column, three radioisotypes took by the multiple multiple universities, including, I talked to several people, oh yeah, we're gonna go to Oregon, yeah, Arizona and we're, we're going to confront them about this. <laughs> no, you're not. No, you're not. None of you can do shit. No, you're not. Out in the street, that's where we'll meet. One. Sample. Three times the background. Two. Fifty times. Three. One thousand times. Let's see, they caught a fish off the coast of Fukushima on day what? Fifty? With 16,000 times in its flesh? Oh, fish swim? Huh. Uh, the logical, the song, the reasoning, the rationale? <laughs> I mean, it blows my mind. Skiers who can't ski, surfers who can't surf, people that go to sports freaking arenas and games of baseball can't even freaking, don't even watch the game. <laughs> What's a double play? I was at the Giants game, by the way, and I did this really cool video. Just They're 30 to 1, just hypothesis in case they did make the World Series. I'll be putting it up, but you'll love it. Wow. They made the World Series. Wow. Wow. I was sitting in that stadium freaking earlier this year when I was in San Francisco. and What the? Double play? We, we like double play, huh? Ooh, yeah. Cultural theme park for fucking Europeans. That's all America fucking is, because if you live here, fugo me not, fugo me not. That's the other great news that's out of here. Some kids in New Jersey won a contest for talking about writing a paper on the fugo bombs. Oh, I wonder who are we heard that one before. Fugo me not, letters from Fukushima. Let's see, at 10,000 feet, I sent my balloon up. Yeah, when I was in very critical condition, fresh out of the bone marrow transplant center. Fugo me not, stop fucking poisoning us with fucking plutonium. How long ago do that? Fugo me not, letters to Fukushima. So, we fight on, it's amazing to me, 1316, 1317 days, and oh, we're thinking about doing a study now. <laughs> what are they, I mean, I would have never believed it in my life growing up in this country. I would have never believed it, that we could evolve into a people like this. No conscience. People are fucking completely fucking numb. Completely or completely fucking gone. I, 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 I'm, I mean, I'm almost at loss for words of what is the matter with people. I mean, skiers who can't ski. Oh, and I can prove it. Right here, right here. Come up, come up with it. Get on the plane. Oh, we're flying from Houston. We bought a house at Park City. We're going skiing. Then I go, so let's go skiing. They don't know how to ski. Oh, we're surfing. I'm on Pacific Beach. I'm on Oceanside. Let's go skiing. Surfing. Don't know how to surf. I'm a journalist. Don't know how to investigate. 
I'm a marine biologist. I don't even know. I've never been on the water. It's not my job to study the ocean. What? 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 That's who we are. That's who we are. Names, title, places. Oh, soon the facade so will burn. Oh, boy. And you want to see something that will blow your mind? Oh, you fucking investment world fucking people that are have no clue, rhyme, no reason. Wow, my big Cassandra like, I'm starting to think, holy cow, you go back. Did a video the day gold hit 1900 saying get out. Did a video the day silver at 47. Did a day, video the day Tesla at 14. I mean, oh, I mean, over and over and over and over again, my friend. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Am I starting to think I'm this heir of Cassandra? Oh boy. I, it has to be. Remember when I made these? I made those on day three. Day three. That's the beautiful thing about this genre. Poof, poof, poof. I found this on the beach. Oceanside, it's a tool. Hanging around their neck, it's old. It's really, really old. How old, I don't know. What were they doing with it? Leather bucks, whaling. Art, carving, I don't know, but remember that rock that I held in my hang? Wow, amazing, huh? It's perfect. Walked up and down that beach so many times. I got news for all of you. You're no match. You're no match for the mighty blue Pacific. I've defended her in a logical way. I've defended the environment in a logical way. I've tried to defend your children. I've tried to defend you, you as a person. People say, hey, let us know what you men eat. And I've done that over and over and over and over. I have coffee in the morning, 20 ounces, black. Maybe a little teeny sweet something. I drink at least that much carrot juice every day, fresh. I eat this fresh salsa that's made from tomatoes, onions, peppers. And I don't want to hear your regurgitation come back to me this way. I'm very, very, very different, my diet, than your diet. I had RCM squared in me multiple, multiple times for months, which is heavy, heavy, heavy. So I've been trying to kick the chemo out different. But I think the one most powerful thing about my survival is walking. Walking. The meditation. Being in symphony with the environment being grounded with a stone in your pocket. Being in the good fight. Standing for her, the mighty blue Pacific, the mother I, for I defended her, she defends me. It's that simple. It's really, it really is that simple. I defend her, she defends me. And I've defended her from freaking before Fukushima even happened. I defended you, and even though you attacked me, that's okay, I don't care. Even the people I defend, attacking me. That's the culture that we live in, the culture of death, the culture of hate, with no conscience. This culture has no conscience. Who believed it ever morphed to this? Fugo me not, letters from Fukushima. The Russian team in there? Hmm. We'll see, we'll see. Wow. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. If you're with me, your rod and your staff, they comfort me. I fear no evil. I've never claimed to know what freaking God is. I've never claimed God speaks to me. I've never claimed to know any of that. You know, I like literature and I like writing and I like, this has been a book. This has been a form of literature. That's literature, what I just read. You know, there were thousands of people that wrote thousands of things, but some of it is so powerful. It's been said for years that literature only changes things around the edges. I've always disagreed at the core of Moby Dick. I mean, I can go on and on and on. There is no wrong or right, there's only popular opinion. Clem, 44, in San Francisco. You go to my website, Blanche Schwartz, the first video I put up there, I think could be my most important, under the bridge in Golden Gate. Those statues aren't there, uh, those pieces of art aren't there anymore. Prisoners from the prisoner. Oh, Kevin, shh, I know you from your YouTube site. Shh, don't tell anybody. But we're, we're not supposed to talk to anybody. We're prisoners from the prison. We're mowing the native marshes, grass. Not supposed to be mowed. That's federally protected wetlands. 
dogs, the usury-based complex, user economy, by definition, dog walkers. That's federally protected marsh, which I was involved with getting it federally protected. Federal protected marsh chasing the blue herons. Noah calls me, has a fit about the freaking sea lion pup. Yeah, as I tried to save them too. I'm like, what about the dog walkers in the federal protected marsh? Oh, we know we have a problem here. Then why don't you fucking do something about it? You wanna see something that'll blow your fucking mind Monday? That will blow your fucking mind. Apple reports their earnings. You're gonna see a number that will fucking make you fall over. They're going to profit for every man, woman, and child on earth, $7 in profit. I mean, it's staggering, staggering what someone can do if they employ slaves. And I'll say this to all you people that think things are from above. No, they're from below. It's grassroots. The problem is not politicians. The problem is not media. The problem is not the Illuminati. The problem is not art, is not culture. Is The problem is us. We is the people. When Barry Antoinette let the meat yellow cake become president, as he disrespects his own mother as a downwinder, like Mike Lee respects his own father as a downwinder, disrespect because they're arrogance. The gen religion, by definition, generational arrogance. As he's called to the White House, Steve, this is Barry Antoinette. What about bringing the jobs back to California, Barry? I got news for you, Brock. They're never coming back. They left it. I got news. The only thing never coming back is Steve Chinese jobs and all of us. The earth will shred us off like freaking fleas. That's George Carlin. So really, who is it? To employ slaves, to usury, to buy the usury based complex. These aren't made by slaves. Oh no, it all ties together. Thus, post ignorance. Letters from Fukushima. Fugo me not. Stop fucking hammering me with plutonium. And I would like to say this to the DU, to the Marines, Semper Fi, Semper Fi, at San Onofre, the Hollywood Marines. That's my people. My father was a special force guy. Nuked to death in the Valley Test site. Tell her human guinea pig him. Teller made that choice. I have data that can prove it and show it. They still have their tonsils in jars at Berkeley. I've been kicked off the campus three times this year alone. At Livermore, Lawrence, Lawrence was an evil, creepy, fucking paranoid freak. Teller was even worse. The two creepiest people, not Oppenheimer. Cal Berkeley has the nerve to even fucking co-op Oppenheimer. That bitch who teaches his fucking thing and uses what they did to Oppenheimer, same thing they did to freaking John Goffman. Sick evil fuckers. Keep using depleted uranium on your own men. Why do you think the Marine broke ranks? Semper Fi, Semper Fi, Semper Fi. Quit killing your own men. Quit fucking poisoning the fucking world to make a bunch of war profiteers creepy fucking scum fucking money. Say this to all the Marines. They went in for a job. To all the army personnel that went to Iraq and went all over. It's not your fault. You're victims. You're victims. Stop taking your own lives. Your victims, it's not your fault. You didn't do that. You didn't do that. You were tricked. You were tricked. I defend you. You didn't do that. Don't take your own life. Don't take your own life. We saw too much of it. Vietnam taught us nothing. Because a bunch of arrogant generational fucking arrogant prick baby boomer assholes. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For you are with me, your rod and your staff, they comfort me. Those are the victims who passed, the 40,000 Semper Fi Marines that Teller made the order to kill them. I have the data. He knew it would kill them, and he did it anyway. And I'll say this to Janet, down there in San Diego, 53 days. We know you have the decision all ready to go. We know. The men on the freaking Reagan, the San Diego Chargers, the practice on it, the kids that practice Little League, go ahead, go ahead. One guy stood up. Oh yeah, I've been there the whole time. I've been there in San... Yeah, I was there this year. What about last year when I was there, too? I've stood for you guys long before Fukushima ever happened. Fuko me not. Letters from Fukushima. She'll defend us. Stand tuned.